the question which comes through is, where has this subject of Mugiki come from? Because no incident has been observed, and you media people have been with us in this nation. What has happened in the last six months to justify the statement and the proposition that there is the emergence of Mugiki? We want to be told of one singular event in any one small village within central Kenya, the broader Mount Kenya, which has prompted this debate. Because we belong here, you belong here, we have not had anything, but all the suddenly, the government, specifically Viruga Chagwa, has announced that there is reminders of Mugiki. Where has that come from? It is not a plot to blood, to profile our youth. We call on critical institutions among them, the Independent Policing Oversight Authority at the core, Kenya National Commission on Human Rights, and the National Cohesion and Integration Commission. We investigate the conduct of police at DCI offices and lead to Maina Jega's homes and the statements by government officials on the so-called resurgence of Mugik sect. Any attempts to profile and vilify the community or to throw back gains made will be resisted very strongly. We will resist KK regime, economic policies that are designed to oppress the life or curtail economic opportunities of any of the communities that make up the state known as Kenya. Many of you might recall that back in the 80s and before we had the cooperative movement. It was the first line of attack by the Moi regime. 